So Derek? Yes. Where are we, uh, can you tell me where we're off to? We are headed to uh, Ivatok Valley on Napak Fjord to uh, try and install some permafrost monitoring equipment. And who are these uh, lovely people you have with you? Um, we've got uh, Carolyn Duchesne and Wendy Slayton from the Geological Survey of Canada. And uh, UB Unatwinuk, our bear monitor. And in front we have Jason, a uh, student who's coming to help us today, and uh, Neil, the pilot. So we're on our way to Ivatok Valley, uh, which is one of our, our focal watershed for the park. We're going to land at an old marine, uh, uh, marine sediment deposit there. One of our challenges is finding rock-free soil so that we can uh, get equipment down to uh, several meters below the soil surface to uh, monitor the subsoil temperatures and permafrost conditions. So we're hoping this will be a good site. Great. And why, why monitor permafrost? Um, permafrost is uh, really important for a whole range of uh, ecosystem conditions. Uh, so, for example, it can have a large effect on hydrology, erosion, plant growth, um, and of course plant growth then can affect a whole host of other organisms, wildlife and things like that, and nutrient cycling, and, uh, even even nutrients going into the rivers, so uh, char and things like that. So, uh, you know, uh, a very critical component uh, of the function of the ecosystems up here. Do you want me to point this out on the map here? Yeah, what is that? So we're going to fly down, we're coming from the south, we're going to fly down the Cornick River Valley, and we're going to turn left and fly up this valley and around to here. And the blue here is actually the glacier, Super Gooksewak Glacier. So we're going to do a turnaround there and then head back out where we're going to be working is at the intersection of the two valleys. And so this is the McCormick uh, 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 Valley, uh, but this is the Ivatak watershed. Um, Ivatak is the uh, traditional name, the Inuit name of the uh, valley. McCormick, or McCormick, depending on which map you look at, um, is a uh, more recent name that's been applied to it, but we're trying to go back and use Inuit names wherever we can, so we're, we refer to it as Ibitak Valley now.